Hey, as you can see, I'm back in Manila and back to the daily grind. Please forgive me for p not missing. Hey, hey, hey! I'm back in Manila and back to the daily grind. So please forgive me for missing out on the last two weeks of vlogging. I took a month long break from work visiting Vancouver, Calgary, and DC. I actually made a little boo boo. I transferred all of the DC videos to Bjorn's computer. You guys know Bjorn. You saw him in the autumn time in the YYC webisode. So I transferred most of my DC videos to his laptop and he's still in Canada. So I gotta wait for him to get back before I can work on the DC webisode. And I want to take my time with that one because DC is my hometown and I want to let you guys see how awesome it is. After visiting DC, I went back to Vancouver and Calgary for a couple of days each. I of course stuffed my face everywhere I went. Thanks for the South Street Burger gift certificates, NG. That's her across the street. Say hi, NG. She took me to this place on 17th Avenue, and now it's my favorite restaurant in Calgary. I left the decision making to NG, who did not want me to record her. We had the ham and cheese pizza, which came with a few surprises like balsamic grapes and caramelized onions. The winner for me was this baked rigatoni with lobster. I mean, look at that cheese! When we opted for the lobster, I thought they'd put just a few tiny pieces of lobster in there, but I was glad to be wrong. At one point, I was actually trying to avoid getting lobster so that NG could have more, but somehow it just kept turning up on my fork. When I got back to Vancouver, I explored more of downtown with a newfound friend. That's I, and she's named after the novelist who wrote that ginormous book with mouse print. We initially set out to try this brunch place called Medina because the online photos of their food looked really good. And I was craving for some waffles. We saw the sign when we got there, and when I learned it was going to be a two-hour wait, I was like, life is too short for long lines. We were raring to start our adventure, so we grabbed some crepe nearby and headed to one of my bucket list destinations. We're at Capilano Suspension Bridge. You really have to walk like that. It's our first time here, even though she lives here. <laughs> These guys are taking it to the next level. Exciting! Seriously. <laughs> What's next, tour guide I? Uh, this must be magical at night. Ooh, it is. It's a maze of interconnected bridges. <laughs> Look around, I. What inspires you? The fog? <laughs> Girl has a point. This is, is it Nature's Edge Walk? Yeah, it's called Nature's Edge, and we've been looking for the edge. And this is where we found it. This is officially the coolest spiral staircase I've ever been on. There's the inspirational fog again. Be inspired. Later that night, I met up with Gail and Wayne. You remember my friend Gail. She was in the I'm in Canada webisode. They took me to my favorite restaurant in Vancouver. Granting, I haven't tried that many restaurants there, but when you know, you know. And that's all for this week. Stay tuned for when Bjorn gets back and I can actually work on my DC webisode. My name is Diane. Hear me.